Today we're going to learn about our collection of gases and the method of collection of gases is based on two things. The first is solubility in water and the second, density. For gases that are insoluble or slightly soluble in water, the method that we use is displacement of water. Some examples include carbon dioxide and oxygen. For gases that are soluble in water and less dense than air, the method that we use is upward delivery. How does upward delivery work? Your gas is supplied to the delivery tube and since your gas is less dense than air, your gas will travel upwards and it will be collected in the gas jar. One example is ammonia. But what happens when your gases are soluble in water and denser than air? The method that we use is downward delivery. For downward delivery, it is actually the opposite of upward delivery, where your gas it is supplied to your delivery tube over here, and since your gas is denser than air, your gas will travel downwards and into the gas jar, and it will be collected in the gas jar. Some examples include chlorine and hydrogen chloride. Density of a gas you need to know that the density of a gas is dependent on the mass of gas. For example, the heavier the mass, the denser it is. And the MR, which is also known as your molecular mass of air, is approximately 28.9. And that is two minutes of chemistry. See you next time.